Hi guys, welcome to another segment of What's Your Issue? I'm Bernice. Onisha. And today, guys, we have a very special guest Yay! with us. His name is Emeka. You guys know mm -hmm. him. Seen him before. Yes, yes, No, yes. he's not a stranger around he's here. He's not, he's not. He's actually one of our very, well, he, he's actually our first ever guest. Was it um, when we launched our, our yes, show? Yes, so you know he's a yeah. member of the family. Yes, he is. Thank you for coming back. Thank you for having me. Absolutely. Um, so, Mecca, do you want to just plug in your social so people can contact you or connect with you? Don't Absol be stalking him. Absolutely. Please don't stalk him. <laughs> stalk him. <laughs> <laughs> Sure, absolutely. The name is Emeka Menakaya, and uh, social media handle is Menax, M E N A X underscore nine nine. Um, I'm also at the Hustlers Corner podcast mm -hmm. and at, at Gamma Label, A G A M A L A B E L, one word. Uh, yeah, you can find right. me on the on socials. Yeah. I hope you guys have been writing this down. Please, oh, check it out. <laughs> Please check out the podcast and all with the other things that Emeka is doing. Please support. Thank you. So, guys. Today we are here because we are going to talk about dating. Mm -hmm. Yes, highly <laughs> requested. Y'all want to know what the mans be thinking. Yes. So we grabbed us a man and we are going to share all our uncensored thoughts. <laughs> wow, this should be a thing. I'm just going to give my perspective. <laughs> Yes, four different guys. They might give you four different. Uh, that's true. What kind of man that they are. That's true. That's true. I'm gonna try to keep it real. Okay. 100%. That's all we want. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you know, dating has changed throughout the years. Back in the day, when our grandparents were dating, you know, it was a little bit more formal. There was some type of courtship, maybe for our parents as well, depending on how old they are. But in this century, with the millennials and technology mm -hmm. things are a bit different yes. so the lines are a bit blurred you're unsure if the guy that's checking you is really interested in you or he mm. just needs a place to crash for the winter <laughs> mm. i mean things happen you don't really know <laughs> so wow. we're gonna you know hopefully help you um shift through some of that by asking some talking some about some general issues that we have about dating and maybe help you guys on how to navigate that yeah let's do it yeah so the first thing that I actually want to talk about, um, since there's a lot of the dating right now is happening online, yes, right, yeah. is you meet a guy online, one mm -hmm. of the popular websites, whatever, or girl, or girl, or girl, yeah, yeah, whomever your your people be, mm -hmm. and say it's a man, for example, let's just mm -hmm. use a man, for example, we have mm -hmm. a man here, <laughs> um, yeah. and you know the date's been set, so who pays for the date? Bernice, what's well, your my on? thing, my take on that would be if the guy had initially asked me, I would expect him to pay on the first date. Um, yeah, I would, I would expect the guy to pay on the first date, and then as time goes on, depending okay, on. Okay, please hold. Please okay. hold about the time. Okay. Mecca. Wait a second. <laughs> no, no. No, 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 no. She has. I feel like her, her, perspe her, her perspective. Okay. Mm -hmm. But I do have a question. Okay. Mm -hmm. If the you said if the guy had suggested yeah. the date, yeah. then you would expect him to pay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, from my perspective, mm -hmm. I think um, any regardless any first date. Yes. Yeah, as a man. Yes. Um, I think the responsibility is for the guy to pay, mm -hmm. especially mm -hmm. if he's interested or fuck it, if either one of them are interested right i think on the first date the guy should offer to pay yeah there's nothing wrong with the girl asking you sure or reach for her purse or a wallet it's gotta be a reach <laughs> <laughs> there has to be a reach on the first date um definitely i think the guy you know it's just you know being a gentleman and having class like yeah it's traditional it's, yeah and just me i'm a little bit of uh you know old school so, right okay um i expect the guy to take care of the bill the first time yes that's on the okay. first date yes no mm -hmm. on the second date the, wait but let's hold on okay. to that that's from misha's perspective <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. misha what do you think uh, i agree with Ameka. i think regardless of who asks, mm -hmm. um i expect the man to pay mm -hmm. um on the first date I, do. I expect the man to pay. Do. Uh, <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> and I think, and I, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I do. And if he, like, if he doesn't, I'm not dating him again. That's me personally. Okay. But what about subsequent dates? Well, how would he not 
Like if he doesn't, there's people one. who want to split. Yeah, they're and they're they want to split the bill up in here. But uh, and I'm not wrong I'm, with that though. I, I think Even there's something the wrong day. on the first day. I don't think there's anything wrong with that either. Yeah. No, with no, that either. Listen, I, if it's like if it's like a meet up, like oh let's meet up and see. For example, if you were hooked, if a friend said, oh you do want to meet my friend, blah blah whatever, then that's different. Then we meet up. We have a meal. We can split the bill because it's technically not a date, right? It's just you're meeting. You've been connected through a friend or mutual mm. acquaintance, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. right? You know, okay, we can do that. However, mm. if we've been talking for a while, say on the online talking site, now then yeah. we've been texted and then yeah. you've planned something, and now you're gonna tell me I'm gonna split it? I think not, sir. Okay, that's different. That's you guys have been talking for a while and whatever. Mm -hmm. That that I agree with you. Then you're in that. You've passed the first date, so yes, I do expect that there should be like a split type of thing but if it's if we're talking about like the first initial dates and whatever then yes the man should really I think take you were, care of it i think she was saying if you guys have been talking for a while and right. then you now go on a date he should take care of it is that what you said that's what I said. is that what you mean okay okay um mm. i kind of sure if 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 you guys have been talking online or through text or whatever for mm -hmm. a while and now you're saying okay let's meet up um, okay. I feel like yeah, the guy should you know. The I, guy should still pay. As a gentleman, he should. But yeah. if, if it's one of those things where, because listen, man, not me, but there are a lot of people, guys <laughs> and girls, yeah, that mm -hmm. go on dates like damn near almost every day. Of the week. That is because that's that's that is free like, meals. Well, <laughs> that's free and that shit adds that's up. true. So I can't fault the guy if he wants to split, especially if let's say you guys connected online. A day or two, mm -hmm. right? Okay. Mm -hmm. And you're like, yo, let's let's meet up for a coffee or whatever. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, I've, I mean, I know there are a lot of women out there that are independent. God bless y'all. Yes. And um, hard out here. Yes. You know, you guys will be like, no, you 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 would offer to pay, and you know, and and that's you know. That's great as well. That's great yeah. as well, but I think the man. Right. Yeah. yeah. Initially, the man should pay, and then if you guys have been talking after that for a while and whatever i agree with nisha where the it can be split definitely there shouldn't really be because i've gone to know you you've gone to know me a mm. little bit better okay you know so what about subsequent dates so say for example now you've been on your first date um this is date number three for example mm -hmm. so do you is the expectation still the same that the man continues to pay or at which point can the woman say i'll cover it um, for me, like around the third date, because I, I've, if it's the third date, then obviously there's a some level of interest, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? And I've kind of gotten somewhat of a gist of kind of like who you are. Mm -hmm. I don't mind paying. I would even be like either we split it or you pay for your own, I pay for my own. Mm -hmm. uh, I have no issues with mm -hmm. paying for myself or splitting it on a third or whatever date. Emeka? On third, right? <laughs> <laughs> What do you think? What's your think, feelings? Honestly, it's really not a big deal for me. Like on the second date, I will. I always offer to pay. Mm -hmm. um, but I've dated women that uh, on the second date they're like, no, 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 no. You got the first one. Let me get this one. Okay, mm -hmm. that's great. And you know that's appreciative. Even though I still, I still, you know, I say sure, sure. Yeah. And when a waitress comes, I give my card to just make sure she doesn't pay. Right. Mm -hmm. okay. um, then on the third. It's all. It's actually. I think that's a bit situational. If there's a place that I really want to take her to, mm -hmm. and it's the third date, um, I'm gonna pay. Okay. Um, okay. But after the first date, if she offers to pay, mm -hmm. um, personally, I don't have a problem saying sure. But mm -hmm. I always uh, just the way I was raised. My mom raised me right, so I always offer to pay first, regardless. Uh, but don't get it twisted, though. We appreciate it when women offer to pay. <laughs> 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 it's true. I mean, nothing wrong with that. Uh, yeah. Nisha, what do you, what's your take on that? Um, you know what? I am... I have no problem paying for a date. Mm-hmm. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I don't. And especially if I initiate something, like there's something that I'm interested in, mm -hmm. I'm like, oh, you know, let's do this. Yeah. Um, I'm okay with paying for it. Mm -hmm. However, when it comes to... I think, for me, the minimum, the first three dates, I expect the man to cover. Why do you expect... Thanks. Exactly. Why is there an expectation? I just hate how you guys be asking me questions. Well, we want to know. What? You were inquiring my wants to know, girl. Um, I'm you know a lot of wine to you know here. Here, here, we'll, we'll slide this over. You know what? <laughs> um, <laughs> um, 
why is there an expectation? Yeah. I just, maybe it's just, I don't want to say how I was raised because that would not be true. That would mm-hmm. uh, be a lie. Mm-hmm. But um, for me personally, I am gauging at this point, I'm gauging his level of uh, interest and commitment to the engagement. Does that make sense? Yes. Pay for the date? Let's, y- yes. Money, let's know. Money is a big thing to people. Yeah. Like money for a lot of people is equal to their time. And if you're gonna, huh, if you're gonna invest your money in somebody, that equals a level of interest. So him investing his time. And money, being, and hold money. On, hold on, hold on, hold <laughs> on. Him investing his time, wanting to see you on the third date, yeah. showing up, being there. So you're like, eh, okay, why here? Well, oh, that's nice. So. <laughs> Yes, this I third date you are still gonna pay. You're yes, still expecting yes, yes. So, no, no, no. So, listen, I am too invested in my time. Oh, okay. Eh, and he took you the first two and dates. Then, and then three again. And three again. Yes, three again, <laughs> sir. See, you have like a very hard stance. Listen, no, like, it has I to can, be the third I, date. If I, if I, and there are a lot of guys that might be like, <laughs> that might be like <laughs> it's the second. <laughs> But I get, I get where Alicia's coming so the, from. So, so the are you gonna thing, move? Are you gonna reach for your personal? Oh, she's not. She already yes. said he, she gonna... intends for him to pay. Hi. <laughs> 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 My friend, <laughs> I'm like, are you gonna reach? I, I might reach. You know, I might reach. I can read the room. Mm-hmm. You might reach. I might reach. We, we can appreciate a reach. I might reach. Okay, but I'm what would what okay, would make you not... reach, though, Nisha? Like apart. Okay, I'll tell you what we'll do. If you reach and he doesn't even move, he's not even budget, and you're reaching. And then what? Then that's. You're gonna stop me? No, no, and then what? You're gonna get up and walk off. No, if I reach and he doesn't move, I'll be like, mm hmm, okay, good. Okay. This is it. But no, uh, let's be real. I'm being real. Mm. I would reach. What would make me reach? Mm -hmm. Um, If we go to a place that, say, it's a little bit more pricey, Mm -hmm. and I order more than I normally would, Mm -hmm. then I would. Obviously, wanna you know? I don't want. I want to put this man out of the pocket. Like I really don't want to put the man out of the pocket. But I do strongly believe there's certain expectations. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna listen, like. Listen, listen, no. If you're going to date, you have to be able to afford yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, definitely. There's definitely. no two way about it. You can't be coming up here, like dressed yeah. up and, and, and to the nine and no. not have and I'm not saying that I want you to cover all the dates because I do not. I really don't. I've gone on dates where I've covered my half. And you know that's been interesting. That's another point here. But <laughs> that actually is what a good point, Nisha. It is. However, part of the conversation. Um, yeah, you need to cover the third day. Minimum three for me. Minimum mm. for you, the man needs to cover. Okay, and that for what you, you that lets you know that that shows a level of investment and in uh, interest. Well, I think personally, as far as level of investments go, uh-huh. I don't think it's the money that determines that. I think it's the time, mm-hmm, the way he responds to you, the way yeah. he treats you yes. while on this date. Yeah, just it can be like on the third day, you guys go to one nice restaurant. You have been drinking, you've been you had dinner, you've been having a great time all night. The bill comes and you don't even flip. Yeah. <laughs> So maybe, I'll, maybe I'll flinch a little. No, no. I mean, there are some guys who don't. That doesn't bother them at all. Yeah, I, I, yeah. And I'm actually true. one of them. Like, I will. I don't mind offering to pay for. That's that's just my nature. Yeah. But it's appreciative if the if the woman offers. Oh, do you, you know? That's, that's yeah. Okay. Well, that's so you want to see that I, the I woman is actually that. considerate and thinking about it. Because let's not get it twisted. Just as you guys expect the guy to be invested in your time and money, right, right, right. I'm right, not right, saying right. that guys expect the same as far as money. Definitely not. Yeah. But we like to feel appreciated as well. Yeah. You guys want to see that the no, consideration I, is there. Right. And I I agree. Do you know? <laughs> <Do you know? laughs> her heart stance on the third date. No, give me. You need to give her a hard time, Rebecca. Because this is what this is about. I, I we need to. Listen, I appreciate it. A good date these days, a good date, you're looking at at least $100. Okay, yeah. that's what I was thinking. The yeah. Average price for a date. Uh, yeah, $100. $100, yeah. Okay, I think yeah. that's... It could be, it could and be... And what order yeah, as well, right? Yeah, exactly. And depending on what you have planned. Some people have outlandish plans that's over $100. Question for yes, you. Yes, I am, I am listening. This, this, <laughs> Don't this, answer it, I don't know. This third day, right? <laughs> this third time you guys have seen each other, right? Yes. So, you know, the guy is taking care of the first one, mm-hmm. the second one, third one. Yes. Uh, are you all going back to your place after this? <laughs> Oh hell no! Okay. No, that, that's not warranted. That doesn't. It's mean, not warranted. It's no, not, no, no, no. But I'm just saying, like. 
Um, there are some guys out there like they've shown like you said yes, level of yes, interest. Yes. They've done the right things. Even though I mean let's not get twisted. The end goal is to, hopefully to be in some type of relationship, relationship of some kind. Some, whatever, yeah. Whatever. However you guys define that. Of who's who you guys though. Well, the guy and the girl. Okay, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought it was you guys and women as opposed to men. No, 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 no. It's, it's whatever, because they're both adults. Yeah, 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 of kind course. Of but what they're looking for. Um, I'm just saying, third date. Yeah, what? Mm, well, yeah it's not enough be, for you, know? you to be getting anything, really. But but that with that being said, I don't think there needs to be like a timeline on, no. well, there has to be this many number of dates before no, we would, can... You know, become physically intimate, but that, that could be the same said for the, the how, like your first initial question, like why should there be a number on dates in terms of who should be paying and when should we split the bill? Like, why do we have to put a number on it? Well. You know what I mean? Like Honestly, that could be that's... said the same thing. So it's like I guess it just depends on the people that are trying to connect and mm -hmm. what it is that they are looking for from each other. And that's fair. I agree. I yeah. think it depends on. On the individual, everyone is everyone is different. Yeah, mm -hmm. there's some been on dates where the girl offered to pay first. Yeah, and I was freaking surprised. I was like, yeah. you know what? I appreciate that, but I, right, yeah, I got you. Well, yeah, I got it. I'm all about split spill. Let's split yeah. it because in case I never call you back for a second date, <laughs> at least I know I covered my ends, and you can't be like, oh, I took Renisa on the date, and all she did was yeah, never call me back. Because this is 2020, right? Uh, and oh, okay. there's been a big push. Um, over the years, you know, for, you know, independence. For oh, women definitely, and, yeah. And Reciprocity and, as well. Okay, and that's important. Yeah. I mean, all those things I totally understand. And I support that. Right, yes. of course. And, and you know, whatever, I can, I appreciate that because I'm feeling I'm a feminist, that's why. <laughs> <laughs> Next question. Mm -hmm. um, how quickly after you've been dating someone, mm -hmm. will you be able to tell if this person's worth their time? That's kind of tricky. I mean, I, yeah, but that, that, that's, that's ballpark. That's even average. Let's not use a third date as an example. <sighs> hmm. I find that kind of hard. It, for me, it, the thing, so, okay. it depends on it, a multiple of a lot of things. So what would give you the indication then? Forget the timeline, but like, because you know, there are people who believe in love at first sight, right? Mm -hmm. So what would give you the, in the, the indication that, um, yeah, this person might be, you know... Really interested? Or we, we could build something. Well, depending on the type of conversations that they're having with okay. me, and um, following through on certain plans that we, we have made. Right, yeah. You know, for me, that would be a big inclination. Mm -hmm. um, if you're not really talking to me about futuristic plans and we're not really coming together or <laughs> whatever, we're not really coming together on, let's just say, one, two little things that you have spoken to me about. And I said, OK, mm -hmm. I'm ready. I'm, re I'm ready to meet you halfway. This is what I can offer. Um, if I don't see certain and if I have to constantly. If I have to even ask you mm -hmm. or bring it up like more than three times then for me I know it's like okay you're not really that <laughs> yeah, but if you're taking the initiative and saying okay you know what we talked about this I'm not expecting you to come and talk to me about it every day right yeah, but yeah. at least to bring it up and be like Bernice I looked into what we talked about mm -hmm. this is my plan and then that for me Nisha and Emeka will give me like it will motivate me mm -hmm. to be like yeah this guy's serious okay so let okay, me yeah. Now mm -hmm. really sit down and I'm willing to meet you halfway. Yeah, yeah. 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 Okay. So yeah. that for me that would be. I would have what to. About you guys? I would have to agree with. This. Yeah, definitely. Um, I think it's 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 very subjective to mm -hmm. the relationship or and, and the person, and, and yeah, the person as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, I think it depends on how often are you guys really communicating? Are you guys? chatting or do you even talk on the phone because these yeah. days people don't talk on the phone yeah right text. exactly yeah and i'm like i said I'm, I'm a bit old school so i might text the first couple times but i like to get a call in you know hear your voice have you hear mine mm -hmm. and, uh, really mm -hmm. build and develop that uh relationship connection, or yeah. that connection um so it just depends if we talk pretty often mm -hmm. um and i see that she's showing interest or if i shoot a text she's not necessarily quick to response but she responds in a timely manner right because I was talking to somebody um, a while back, and apparently there are games that girls play. Correct me if I'm wrong. Yeah. Correct this is what I heard. <laughs> a guy would text a girl in the morning, let's say, I don't know, 10 a.m. 
Yeah. How are you? How's your day? Wishing you a great day. Blah blah blah. Right. You might not get a text at like 4 p.m. No. no. She got this like in the morning. She's saying what she said. The friend that I talked to, she was saying that um, that your girls don't want to show. Uh, desperation or whatever. That, you know, I think that's childish. I, I, I yeah. like that's some bullshit. Like, <laughs> that's some, like we're adults. If I shoot you yeah. a text, checking in on you, blah blah blah, and you don't have the time, you know, you're playing games to respond back at four. That tells me a lot. That's not. Yeah, that's, that's not how I want to build this connection at all. Mm -hmm. no, I'm making myself available to you anymore. I don't have to. This is me checking in on you. Wishing yeah, you mm -hmm. of course. If, you're not, if it's not reciprocated, then yeah. Yeah, and and that's just. I, maybe certain women do that. Yeah, um, not all women. But yeah, I no, think uh, that's very childish. Like, if somebody is checking in on you, taking the time to see how you are, I think it's the base. It's polite to even respond and say, "Hey, I'm good. Thanks for checking in. I yeah. appreciate it." You know? How are you? No. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. How? Yes. How are you? <laughs> no, I'm saying people tell them that they want that chase. They want to know that, like. You know what? They have you kind of like long, late, yeah, late waiting. waiting. You're the one that's mm -hmm, gonna be texting mm -hmm. them. They're gonna text you whenever mm -hmm. they feel like, but you must be the one to call and be like, mm -hmm. or call or text the moment you get up. They're gonna take their time to respond to you because mm -hmm. they have you, according to them, where they want you. And you know what? There's nothing wrong with the chase. I enjoy the chase, mm -hmm. but at least keep giving me the green light. Yeah, Very yeah. <laughs> Don't have me chasing darkness. Like <laughs> Not even <laughs> responding, you're not. Yeah, I think my, my attention will go. Oh, definitely. Quickly. So if you're not still giving me, keeping me interested, giving me that green light, communicating. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, that's, yeah I think that's that's. You gotta know your worth. Yeah. Exactly. You so, have to know your worth. Definitely. Um, but let me answer the question. Yeah, yeah you, we have to get your perspective. Well, um, I I agree with you. Um, in the sense that it needs to be reciprocated. Mm -hmm. Um, but. Initially, if I'm talking to someone, um, the way in which we communicate, like I very much like to get to know, like not who you're performing or who you want people to think you are, yeah. but who you mm -hmm. are, right? Yeah. And I understand that that takes time and a level of comfort, mm -hmm. but there's also, there are people who like, they date by numbers. I don't know if that makes sense. Yeah, like yeah. They have these specific things that they have to check mm -hmm. off, right? Yeah. But I want to genuinely see the type of person you're like, if you say stupid things or you're kind of silly or you don't know all the rules or the expectations, like just be who you are, yeah. Yeah. then that will, I'll be able to determine like the, the type of person, the qualities that you're going to bring to my life. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, definitely. Um, so you're right. It is a tricky question because you, there's not really a set amount of time um, that you can really determine. I mean, some people, they're, assholes from the jump and yeah like, and you're like i'm not feeling mm -hmm. you hell this fucking no this one's not for me. yeah and then there are people who will pretend yeah. to give you what they think you, you want know. right oh, to oh, get yeah. what they want so it's it's very tricky yeah but i think you just have to pay attention to really how a person follows through with what they say they're yeah. going to do and their mannerism and how consistent they are yeah and that for me that's the indication that's what i used to to, yeah. to decide okay is this somebody who's worth my time you know i feel like if a guy is interested in you or if a girl is interested mm -hmm. in you, you will know. Yeah. Like she will yeah. or he will, you know, make time. Yeah. Yeah, you don't have to fight for it. You don't feel like you're like you're like wrestling with this person to commit yeah. to one thing. You won't there won't be any excuses. You'll just you'll know because the person will be available to you.